well, this is different. Listen up, everyone. I am about to tell you something very important. On the day that I post this review, the one that you're watching right now, it is a Tuesday. Now, if you're a little confused as to why that's so important, well, let me tell you. You see here on the Fast Foodies, Tuesdays means one thing and one thing only. Say it with me. It's time to crumble. And if you didn't know that Tuesdays means crumble cookie reviews, then you're probably not subscribed to the Fast Foodies. But don't worry. Don't worry. You can change that very easily by, well, hitting that subscribe button. And then you won't miss out on next week's Crumble Cookie Reviews or the, the week after that or the week after that. Because as I said, every Tuesday, I'm gonna be here reviewing some cookies. Now that everyone's subscribed and a part of the Fast Foodie Nation, I can let you guys in on a little secret. You see, even though I post these Crumble Cookie Reviews every Tuesday, I don't always film them on a Tuesday. And I'm actually filming this review on a Monday. Or should I say, mini Monday? If you guys didn't hear the news, then prepare to be shocked. You see, Crumble Cookies just came out with mini versions of their cookies. Now I know, I know, you guys have probably seen them in the stores, you know, the little, the miniature versions, but those have only been available for catering. Starting this week, every Monday, mini Monday, you can buy a three pack, six pack, or even a nine pack, I believe, of their, well, mini cookies. And honestly, I think this is a great idea. You know, you can try out cookies that you've never had before, and you can get more uh, variety. Whereas before, you know, you kind of only, you kind of stuck with one because their cookies, they're so darn big. One cookie will fill you up. But now, yeah, you can get a, a whole bunch of cookies. Now, pricing wise, this three pack costs nine dollars which is almost two crumble cookies so i think it's a little bit more expensive <laughs> um yeah i would have preferred to see this around the six and a half to seven dollar mark but hey i'm not here to complain i'm just so excited to finally try out a mini crumble cookie because I've only ever had the big ones. I've never been to an event where they catered crumble cookies. So I don't know if crumble can truly replicate that same crumble experience you get in a big cookie in, well, mini version. And obviously, as you guys can see, I did not get every cookie on the menu because even these mini cookies, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know how well this review would go if I had all what four or five of this week's cookie in one review but in the future if you guys want me to review mini cookies or regular cookies just drop a comment in the comment section down below great now let me tell you which cookies i got i had to go with the og milk chocolate chip uh, that's kind of like a baseline you know so i got the og milk chocolate chip and then i actually went with two other cookies that I've had the regular versions before, so I could compare them to. The first one is the Caramel Praline Cookie. Now the Caramel Praline Cookie, I have my notes right here, is a brown sugar cookie covered with a smooth buttery caramel and topped and sprinkled with crunchy pecans. And I gotta be honest with you guys, I am very impressed that they were definitely able to replicate the same visual experience in a mini form. But as I mentioned the taste, well, we still have yet to find out. And then the third and final cookie I got was the Galaxy Brownie. Now this Galaxy Brownie cookie, it is, let's see, it is a brownie cookie covered in a warm fudge glaze and sprinkled with rainbow candies so i think today i'm gonna start with the og milk chocolate chip i think uh yeah we'll start with this one the safe one and then we'll work our way down i'm just gonna have a small bite from each of them because as i mentioned these are sweet i'm not gonna do three crumble breaks in a row i'm just gonna break off a little piece right here uh, Ah, 
I haven't had the uh, the crumble OG chocolate chip, milk chocolate chip cookie in a minute, in a hot minute. But um, as far as I can remember, it tastes the exact same. This is, oh yeah. We are off to a very strong mini crumble review. Next up, let's go with the, uh, we'll go with the, we'll go out of this world. Take a little trip to outer space, try out this galaxy brownie. This will be interesting to see how the, uh, the brownie cookie base tastes in a mini version. That's rich. That is definitely, mmm. I think the one, the, probably the biggest difference actually between the regular cookies and these mini cookies is going to be that frosting. Because in the big cookies, I mean, they slather that frosting on. So I think that the ratio from cookie to frosting will be a bit bigger in <laughs> these mini cookies. Whereas in the regular cookies, more of the actual cookie eating experience will be coming from the frosting on top. Now, last but not least, we have the caramel praline. As you can see, that frosting or that glaze, it's not as thick as you would see in a normal cookie. Same with the pecans. I mean, you get a, a little bit here and there, but in a regular size cookie, this would be loaded with even more chopped pecans on top and just a thicker layer of that glaze. But yeah, flavor wise, as far as I'm concerned, it's pretty much the same. So what are my thoughts, my takeaways, the lessons that I learned from this mini crumble review? There's one thing I learned, it's that crumble can in fact do mini. Now you may be asking yourself, Parker, when I go to crumble, which one should I get? And honestly, it's going to come down to you. Do you want just one, one entire, you know, if you made it to the end of this video, then I'm sure that you want to become a fast foodie as well. So all you have to do is hit that subscribe button and to see exclusive behind the scenes footage, then you can head on over to Instagram and follow the fast foodies at fast foodies review.